As I said in the previous video, this is a series of speed tests. Today's speed test is a little different. As you all know, I have been using Hydrogen OS, which is based on Android Pie. That is a beta software, of course. But what we're going to do here is we're going to test between Hydrogen OS, which is based on Android 9, versus Oxygen OS, which is based on Android 8. Now, both the devices in question are OnePlus 6 with 6 gigabytes of RAM, and they have similar apps. Almost, almost everything is similar, and we will go ahead and check if Android 9 makes a huge difference or not. So before we begin a speed test, well, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video. At the same time, here's a card to my second channel that is Kratos390. Go ahead and check that channel out as well. Now, without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. All right, guys, so to the left, we have Android P Beta Hydrogen OS, and to the right, of course, we have 5.1.11. Both of them are the same devices as I mentioned earlier. Starting with the easy benchmarking applications, move on to speed test. Both of them are running neck in neck. And now we come to the heavy section wherein we are launching Asphalt 9. Now, this is a new game by Gameloft, and it's pretty, pretty heavy on phones. But this being a flagship with a Snapdragon 845 should not really have a problem. And the whole idea of the speed test is to check if there are any major optimizations. And as you can see in load times, Android P has already pulled ahead and Android 8.1 is behind. Let's see how it changes over a course of time. Now we are launching the second heavy game right now, which is Player Unknown's Battleground and still Android P 9.0 beta continues to keep the lead now if you've seen one of my previous videos here's a card to that that is note 9 versus one plus six the note 9 although it just has six gb ram just like the one plus six was able to hold apps in memory much much better so the main reason we are doing the speed test is i wanted to check if there is any kind of memory optimization that oneplus have done in android 9.0 which will allow us to keep heavy games in memory coming back to the speed test right now well as you can see there is a very very slight margin of difference between the two hardly you know a second or probably less than a second and both of them are lightning fast but android p beta continues to lead by example let's see what happens over here we are towards the end of the test and here we go So Android P wins the first round and now we will start loading apps again and see which apps are in memory. Now with light apps there is no problem as such, all of them are kept in memory. Android O has started reloading apps and same is the case with Android P. Modern Combat 5, no. Now the reason I'm just you know leaving from the game loading screen is because it's going to load the game again and doesn't really make any sense. But coming back to the end of the test, yes, there is hardly any difference when it comes to a speed test between Android O and Android P, although P is in beta right now. But for now, what I can conclude is more or less the experience is same. It's just the animations, the capacity to keep apps in memory is exactly similar between Android O and Android P. So this was the speed test. Let me know in the comment section, guys, if you liked it or not. And there are a couple of speed tests more that are going to come and there is a surprise video coming up as well until the next one this is kalash signing off at smartphone tutorials keep smiling take care goodbye